Hi guys, Marcus here, and welcome to Chinese Entertainment Update, March 1st, 2020 edition. In this edition, Huang Xiaoming fights back and the top 10 Chinese dramas and actors at the moment. But first, The Romance of Tiger and Rose is an upcoming costume drama starring Zhao Lushi and Ryan Ding. Zhao Lushi plays a script writer who accidentally enters her own script, but instead of becoming the heroine, she becomes a minor character who she eventually kills off. While in there, she also meets a rich young master and a minister of education, and romance and comedy ensues. The lovable Zhao Lushi is making a habit of starring in time or universe traveling dramas. She starred in both seasons of Oh My Emperor, and then more recently in Love Better Than Immortality, both of which featured that theme. Ryan Ding, on the other hand, is a bit more diverse, but for me, his most memorable role was a new smiling proud wonder where he played Dongfang Bu Bai. So if an actor is successful in a certain type of drama, should he or she just keep churning them out because fans love them, or should they seek something new to expand their horizon? What do you guys think? And from one drama where a modern character gets transported to a different world, we go to yet another one. Love and the Emperor is an upcoming costume drama starring Camille Hua and Ellen Luo, and it is slated to premiere on March 4th. The title, Love and the Emperor, sounds like a regular Chinese drama, not as outstanding as the title of the novel it's based on, Sun Gong Chou Nu, which literally translates to, Ugly Woman Deep in the Palace. Camille Hua stars as a virtual reality game tester who finds herself transported into her game and becomes, as the novel title suggests, an ugly palace maid. Alan Luo stars as the dashing young emperor she serves and falls in love with. The drama is slated for 24 episodes and will premiere on Mango TV. I will update again if and when it becomes available with English subs. Skate Into Love is an upcoming youth romance drama starring Janice Wu and Steven Zhang. Yo-Yo, which is the drama's official channel on YouTube, recently released trailers and a behind-the-scenes video for it. Does that mean it'll premiere soon? We'll see. Drama List has it as premiering on March 19th, but there's no mention of it on their Weibo page yet, so we'll see if that materializes. Skate Into Love tells the story of an aspiring speed skater played by Janice Wu, who ends up being the assistant to an ice hockey legend played by Steven Zhang. What makes it interesting is that she used to bully him when they were younger. Skate Into Love is produced by Andy Liu, who also did the super popular Ashes of Love with Yang Zi and Deng Lun. He said that Deng Lun will make a special appearance on Skate Into Love, but I haven't seen any of his posters on their Weibo page yet. Maybe those will come later. By the way, many of you have asked what's going on with Ashes of Love 2. Well, nothing has developed since my last update, which is that they're working on it, and that it will possibly be about the two lead characters' kids. And apparently, Yang Zi and Deng Lun will not return as leads. I will give more updates on that as they provide them. Rumors spreading netizens strike again. This time, the target is Huang Xiaoming. Huang Xiaoming, who's Angela Baby's husband of almost five years, was recently linked with the Uyghur starlet Hani Kezi. 24-year-old Hani Kezi is an actor. I looked her up and found that she has two supporting roles in dramas that have not premiered, but somehow she has over 600,000 followers on Weibo. Anyway, Huang Xiaoming has hit back by threatening legal action. According to his lawyers, they've requested a legal disclosure of three Weibo users' real identities so they can sue them. I've always wondered how that would work though. If I remember correctly, when I signed up for Weibo, all I needed was an email address. So my impression was that anyone could create an account with a random email address. That's why there's so many keyboard warriors who slander away with impunity. In any case, good on Huang Xiaoming for taking a strong stance on the issue. He also posted on Weibo recently saying that he is filming in Chengdu and that at the moment he's holed up in isolation in his hotel following the control measures because of the epidemic. Hopefully, this whole situation resolves for him sooner rather than later. And before we get to the top 10 Chinese dramas and actors at the moment, a quick word on ExpressVPN. Whether I'm at home or traveling, the first thing I do before I surf the net is log on to ExpressVPN and connect to a server. Not only do I use ExpressVPN to protect my data from spies and hackers, I find it especially useful to unblock geo-restricted content like dramas and movies on YouTube, Netflix, and other websites. ExpressVPN is giving away 3 extra months free on a 12-month plan to all viewers of my channel. 
All you have to do is use the link in the description box below, expressvpn.com forward slash Marcus Sim. And now, the top 10 Chinese web dramas at the moment, edition 9, March 1st, 2020. The data is provided by VLinkage, a marketing consultant company based in Shanghai. The list is based on view counts on Tencent, IGE, and Youku, social media discussions, and Baidu searches. Number 10, Liu Laogun Season 3. The modern drama stars Zhao Bunshan and Fan Wei. Number 9, Miss Truth. The costume drama stars Zhou Jiecheng and Toby Lee. Number 8, Country Love Season 12. The modern drama stars Bi Chang and He Shufeng. Number 7, Forward Forever. The Republican era drama stars Huang Zitao and Jackson Yi. Number 6, Well Intended Love Season 2. The modern drama stars Xu Kai Cheng and Simona Wang. Number 5, The Great Ruler. The costume drama stars Roy Wang and Ouyang Nana. Number 4, Under the Power. The costume drama stars Ellen Run and Seven Tan. Number 3, I Partment 5. The modern drama stars Michael Chen and Laura Liu. Number 2, The Love Lasts Two Minds. The costume drama stars Ellen Yu and Yuki Chen. And number 1, Eternal Love of Dream. The costume drama stars Dil Raba and Vengo Gao. So Miss Truth, which premiered on Valentine's Day, climbs into the list at number 9. The drama is gaining more viewers as it progresses. Eternal Love of Dream remains at the top from last week. In fact, all top 5 dramas remain the same. And now the top 10 Chinese TV dramas at the moment. These are based on TV ratings and social media discussions in China, and they include reruns. Number 10, Guardians of the Ancient Oath. The costume drama stars Leo Wu and Lorena Song. Number 9, The Sky is the Sky. The historical drama stars Zhang Jiayi and Zhang Yan. Number 8, Insects Awaken. The Republican era drama stars Zhang Ruoyun and Angel Wang. Number 7, Find Yourself. The modern drama stars Victoria Song and Song Weilong. Number 6, Court Battle. The modern drama stars Yu He Wei and Carlina Zhang. Number 5, Switch of Fate. The Republican era drama stars Sarah Zhao and Angel Liu. Number 4, New World. The Republican era drama stars Sun Hongley and Zhang Luyi. Number 3, Wait in Beijing. The modern drama stars Li Yifeng and Maggie Jiang. Number 2, I Will Find You a Better Home. The modern drama stars Sun Li and Luo Jing. And number 1, Perfect Partner. The modern drama stars Huang Xuan and Tong Li Ya. The immediate difference I see is that the top two web dramas, The Love Lasts Two Minds and Eternal Love of Dream, are costume ones, whereas the top two TV dramas, I Will Find You a Better Home and Perfect Partner, are modern ones. I think this is a reflection on viewers' tastes as much as it is on censorship regulation of TV versus web dramas. And now the top 10 Chinese drama actors at the moment. Also provided by VLinkage, the list is based on drama performances, social media discussions, and Baidu searches. And on this list, there's no separation between web and TV, it's just drama actors as a whole. Number 10, Wang Yibo. He is currently filming Legend of Fei with Xiao Liying. Number 9, Yang Zi. She recently wrapped filming Oath of Love with Xiao Zhan. Number 8, Xiao Zhan. He recently wrapped filming Oath of Love with Yang Zi. Number 7, Van Gogh Gao. He currently stars in Eternal Love of Dream with Dil Raba. Number 6, Ellen Run. He recently starred in Under the Power with Seven Tan. Number 5, Roy Wang. He currently stars in The Great Ruler with Ouyang Nana. Number 4, Seven Tan. She recently starred in Under the Power with Ellen Run. Number 3, Jackson Yi. He currently stars in Ford Forever with Huang Zitao. Number 2, Ellen Yu. He currently stars in The Love Last Two Minds with Yuki Chen. And number 1, Del Raba. She currently stars in Eternal Love of Dream with Van Gogh Gao. So Van Gogh Gao finally makes an appearance in the top 10 after weeks of Eternal Love of Dream airing. Victoria Song, despite being number 1 last week, drops out of the list after Find Yourself ends its run. So there you go guys, hope this gives you an idea of who and what drama's hot in Chinese drama land at the moment. And that's it for this edition guys, this show would not be possible without your support whether it's through Patreon or simply by watching, liking and subscribing. So thank you all for watching and as always, I wish you clear blue skies, good health and happiness. Until next time, cheers!